Hi, I'm Dr. Shivani and today we have an honor to share the platform with Dr. Vineet Kumar. Hello everyone, my name is uh, Vineet Kumar. I'm from Bangalore. I did my UG from Bangalore Medical College and I secured rank 3 in PGI, rank 3 in GIPMER, rank 33 in AIMS. So I started preparing uh, uh, by the selected the sources which has very good uh, information and uh, which is reliable and which I can revise at the end. So I decided to go for some source which had very good, uh, very easily preparable source. I chose the rapid revision. You were following uh, what kind of uh, strategy? Were you solving the notes or the videos or the cue banks? What was the sequence actually? Most of the time I used to read notes, high yielding notes, rapid revision notes I used to read and I solve questions. and. Uh, if I found anything extra from the questions, I used to add that to the notes and uh, at the end, uh, only in the last 20 days, I read only notes. I thought I should not uh, go beyond what I know, be thorough with what my source was and uh, I did that. I like I did uh, three more revisions of uh, rapid revision notes, whatever I was reading, I read at least three times and uh, in the last one week, uh, I did only volatile stuff from the rapid revision notes. And, uh, it was like uh, before AIMS, AIMS was on uh, 11th, I finished entire rapid revision notes in two days before the NEET, b before the AIMS exam. In PG PJ was like three days after the AIMS exam. I did nothing uh, for PJ. I just uh, watched some movies and I was in, I went uh, with clear mind so that uh, PJ exam went well, that's why. Now talking about rapid revision, what is your favorite part? My favorite part, I would say notes. Uh, who are made notes, they have compiled everything what is needed in that notes and extra things you can add so that you'll remember it. If you add, keep adding more, more. Uh, if you add more, you'll forget what you have known before. Right. So you should limit where, what to know and you should keep revising it. Revision is the only thing which can get you better ranks. Rapid revision notes I have done at least uh, three, four times. We do have a snapshot in this uh, rapid revision course. So in central institutes, many questions are image based questions. So how helpful it was for the central institute? It is very helpful. Like uh, I was very weak in forensic subject. Mm. I saw Magendran sir snapshot video. Then uh, like forensic, it was not a problem for me. In snapshot, he covers theory along with the images. It was very helpful. And uh, rapid revision notes with snapshot with the rapid revision video, it was enough for me. We also have a feature known as treasures in the rapid revision where we have concised all the information into a table form. So how helpful that can be for a student who is preparing for the exam? Yeah. That can make a lot of difference. Like if you are, uh, you should know what is important and you should uh, stress what you have to read uh, before the exam. Yeah. Many people fail uh, like before seven days what they should read. They'll get confused and they'll read some stuff which is not important. I'll tell them to read, uh, focus on previous year topics and uh, things like treasures. You have to revise at least uh, one or two times before the exam. What piece of advice would you like to give to them? So I would tell them to prepare for that pattern do at least uh, two to three year previous year papers, be thorough with the repeats and uh, if you, you should not miss repeats and you should not do silly mistakes. If you can do that, you can almost uh, get a very good rank. And if a student is now appearing just after two days, so if one message you have to share for all the students, what it will be for you? I would say whatever you know, you should read that. If you keep, uh, if you read something you don't know, you'll get stressed and your performance will decrease. You just read what you know and high yielding stuff like treasures and rapid revision notes. In rapid revision notes, you have marked some important points. Just uh, go through that uh, before uh, the day of exam. That will help.